Now keeping you and your family safe. This is Two Works For You Weather, certified most accurate. All right, if you have any outdoor chores mm -hmm. that you need to get done, you better get to them today. This weekend's probably not going to work out. This is one of these things that this forecast, as you probably know, we're expecting thunderstorms, mm -hmm. but it looks like that most of the weekend may actually be okay for your outdoor adventuring. It's oh. probably going to take a long time for the storms to actually get here. Well, there you go. There's <laughs> so, some good news. So that, that's kind of what we're going with for now. Let's, we're going to give you the most, most detailed info we can here. Today's big weather story is the weekend's big weather story, strong storms in Oklahoma. Now for today, a few strong storms are possible. A slight risk means there won't be many storms, but the storms that develop will be strong to severe and hail will be the main threat in the thunderstorms. This map shows Kansas, western Oklahoma toward Oklahoma City, and we could see a few strong storms approaching the Tulsa area today. Tomorrow, a rare high risk for severe weather has been issued. Now on this map, I've drawn the high risk slightly farther west from the official prediction from the Storm Prediction Center as it looks like that the main piece of the jet stream energy is going to be a bit farther to the west and a little later in the day. Bottom line, central western Oklahoma and Kansas have the highest risk of strong storms and it's going to tail off fairly quickly as you make your way toward Tulsa and especially east of Tulsa. So for the specifics tomorrow, Tomorrow morning, if you have plans, only expecting isolated thunderstorms. Only means a few thunderstorms out there. Tomorrow afternoon will be mostly dry. The thunderstorm chances in Green Country and the Tulsa area, that won't be arriving until Saturday night and possibly early Sunday morning. As far as the temperatures today, we're on the way toward the mid-70s. 72 at noon, 74 at 3 p.m., 75 cloudy and breezy by 5 p.m. Right now we're sitting at 70 degrees. It's breezy, it's humid, a south wind at 18 miles per hour. Temperatures around the rest of Green Country in the upper 60s and lower 70s with almost a due south wind and the weather will stay windy all weekend. Viper 2 HD, nothing showing up near the Tulsa area for now and we're not going to see that much rain in Green Country today. Heavy rain, large cluster of showers and thunderstorms to our north and east in Missouri. That rain will continue moving away from Green Country. But we are going to see a lot of clouds across our part of the state today with gradually more clearing and the somewhat drier air to our west. Now, the future cast, the computer models have been having a real tough time with the rain chances. I don't think we're going to see as much rain as it's showing, but the trend will see more thunderstorms developing this afternoon out toward western Oklahoma. And it's possible that we could see a few thunderstorms developing late tonight and moving in tomorrow. Then the main event will be developing during the day tomorrow with strong thunderstorms. Storms moving, developing in western Oklahoma, then during the overnight hours, making their way toward green country. So the specifics today, 75 degrees, only a low chance for rain today. South wind to 15 to 30 miles an hour, and temperatures around the rest of green country in the mid-70s. Now we do have a chance for thunderstorms overnight. Any thunderstorm that develops could have hailstones. Park your car inside the garage. We'll see a low of 65 in Tulsa and mid-60s around the rest of green country, so rather mild temperatures. So for tomorrow, our best chance for thunderstorms will be late in the day into Saturday night and Sunday morning. Rainfall totals are going to be fairly low as the storms will be moving fairly quickly. Next week looks uneventful with drier weather returning by Monday. So it looks like that the main area of tornadoes looks to be in central and western Oklahoma, and it may be a tightly clustered area, mm -hmm. meaning is that you go either side of it, there won't be as many severe weather reports. That's what it looks like for now. Dan Threlkel to have a complete update tonight at 5, 6, and 10. Things can always change. Mm -hmm. Thanks, George.